channel. So for today we're going to be doing a March favorites or a current favorites video. I have a whole pile of stuff next to me and I'm really excited to show you guys what I'm loving right now. So if you want to see, keep on watching. So the first category I'm going to be going through is books. I have four books here that I'm really loving right now. Um, the first one is called Never Split the Difference and it is by Chris Voss. Um, I actually found this book because Morgan Yates was talking about it on her channel. Um, I just started it. It's pretty good so far. Um, I would definitely recommend it if um, you are into learning about negotiations. Um, he was a, a former FBI top hostage negotiator. So he talks about that a lot. Um, and it's a really good book so far, so I definitely recommend this one. You can get it on Amazon. Everything will be linked down below also if you want to buy anything. Um, the second book that I'm really liking right now is called Why Didn't They Teach Me This in School? And it's 99 Personal Money Management Principles to Live By. This book I've actually learned a lot from. Um, there's a lot about spending habits and budgeting. It's definitely a book that would help any adult. And I really, really recommend this one if you want to learn how to manage your money better. The third one... Me and my best friend Rachel actually both have this and we both really like it. Um, it's called 3,000 Questions About Me. It's from Target. I usually will sit down um, at the end of my night in bed and just run through a few questions. That's how I put myself to sleep at night. The fourth book that I have is my planner. This is the absolute best planner I've ever owned and I've owned a lot of them. Um, it just has my name on it and it says 2020 planner with my initials in the corner. Excuse my nails. I haven't been able to get them done because of quarantine. Um, but I really, really like this book. It has the uh, month layout and then after the month layout, you can do like notes and monthly goals to do lists. And then it also has um, every day or week. It's by the company Pop Papier. Um, I personally love this planner. I use it all the time. I have my to-do list um, for today in it, um, and I've been checking things off. This is my all-time favorite thing in the world. Definitely recommend getting a planner. Um, it really, really helps you organize your day. So, on to the next category is food and snacks. So, um, I actually found these because of Remy Cruz or Miss Remy Ashton. Um, they are Smart Sweets. Um, the Smart Sweets gummy bears, the sour and the regular, are my favorite. Um, they have sour and then I think the other flavors like fruity or berry or something like that. But these are so good. I usually can't eat a whole pack at once, but they're a good snack to just be able to grab and eat really quick if I just want something small. And then something that I use as a treat for myself um, is Bark Thins, and it's the dark chocolate pretzel with sea salt, and they are so good. This is a new bag, but um, this is one of my favorite snacks. I will usually just have a couple of pieces of this at night as like a dessert, but definitely recommend trying these out. I usually get them at either CVS or Target. Okay, so on to products. I have a few products that I really, really like. Um, makeup products. The first one would be the Pore Professional Pore Primer from Benefit. So this is what I use on my face as a primer. It's super soft. It makes my skin feel really, really soft. It's not oily. It doesn't make my skin oily. Um, and it just goes on really, really smooth and nice. So I would definitely recommend this if you're looking for a good smooth primer. You don't have to use a lot either. And it's great to have um, just as a base. The second thing that I am so obsessed with, it's actually horrible. It's this Evian facial spray. And it's just these little travel bottles. I got it from Sephora. Um, I will spray this on my face like three, four, five, six times a day. Um, and it really gives you that extra boost of energy and it makes me feel really refreshed. Um, so I definitely recommend if you're looking for something to just spray and refresh your face during the day, this is definitely a good one to have. Okay, so next thing is I actually um, found these from Danielle Carolyn and I really, really like them. It's the Sephora Glow Peel Pads and it looks like this and it just comes in this little container. 
and it has um, so it comes with a rough side as well as a smooth side and you're supposed to take the it's not rough but it's like what do they call it the embossed side of the disc and rub it in circular motions and it's really good to just take everything off your face um, it makes your face feel really nice after nice and smooth um, so I definitely recommend these if you're looking for a good just end of the day first thing in the morning just do a wipe of your face this is definitely what I would recommend now I have never been more obsessed with a product from Amazon than this little tiny tiny thing so this is called the flawless hair remover so it's this little tiny 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 thing and you flip it on and it has a light and then there's a disc on top and you will never have to go get waxed ever again. This thing is the greatest thing to ever exist. It literally took me two seconds to use it. And it was better than getting waxed. So if you're looking for a good hair remover and you don't want to get waxed anymore, I got you right here. Perfect product. All right. Next, clothing and shoes. You can never go wrong with clothing and shoes. This sweater, I got it from an online store called VC Collection. This oversized blue sweater is so soft. It's so cute to have just off the shoulder. I usually will wear it with just jeans off the shoulder with a really cute like white broadline underneath. If I have a picture of me in it, I'll insert a picture, but I'm not sure if I do. It's not heavy, but it's not light. So it's kind of that perfect in between. This is definitely a sweater that I would recommend anybody get. All right, now next, jeans. I buy all my jeans from American Eagle. And these jeans that I'm wearing right now are the best jeans I've ever owned. They are the curvy high-rise jeggings and they have rips all the way down both legs and on the back. They are so stretchy and so comfortable for jeans and if you're looking for a good pair of comfy jeans go get them at American Eagle. They are so comfortable. My next clothing item is this black long sleeve crop top from Garage. So this I got this in a medium Oh, my jeans are a four, by the way. I got this in a medium, and we I definitely needed the medium. Um, it hits right where um, like a good pair of high-waisted jeans would hit, so they kind of meet, but if you stand up, you get like a little bit of stomach. It has this really nice like little V, like a structured V in the middle. I don't know if you can see it, but it's got like this really nice structured V in the middle. So this is super soft really good to wear with like high-waisted jeans now we have tech products so i have a couple little tech things here and there um my favorite thing right now that i just got on amazon is this computer adapter so i have the newer macbook so i have a USB-C ports instead of the regular usb ports so i got this on amazon i can plug this part into my computer and then this part has the sd cards and the usb ports so this is really, really good to have for my computer. Um, I can plug in my uh, SIM cards for my camera. I can plug in my ring light if I need to um, onto into one of the USB ports. So I would definitely recommend if you're looking for a good adapter for your computer, uh, this one, it was super cheap. I think it was like $20 on Amazon or something like that. This is definitely worth it. My next tech, tech accessory is my wireless Beats. I got these when I got my computer but I got the all black matte beats. I love these for if I'm cleaning the house or if I'm doing a workout downstairs. I'll even just put these on in the morning when I'm making breakfast and let's do a podcast. Um, these are my all time favorite headphones I've ever owned. I love beats. So yeah, if you're looking for a good pair of headphones, right here. All right, next is my laptop cases. So I get my laptop cases on Amazon, but it's from this company called Mos Mosiso. I'll link it down below. I'll link all of them down below. But I got, I have this clear one that just has, I just put a bunch of stickers on it um, from like local businesses and stuff like that. I love these. Um, and then I also have this flower one. It's front and back. And then I also have a all black one that's on my computer right now. 
And I also have the keyboard cover and I love having the keyboard cover. I just really like the way it types better. And also every single case you get comes with a screen protector for your laptop. So I would definitely recommend getting these. They're really good quality. They don't scratch. Um, and they're just super simple. Just pop on, pop off, done. Okay, on to accessories. So my current obsession that I just got in the mail, I have these Key Australia blue light glasses that I just got. They are amazing. They help my eyes so much when I'm staring at my computer, my TV, anything. I got them in this really nice tortoiseshell print. I don't know if you can see. So I got them in the tortoiseshell print for my blue light glasses. Blue light glasses are called the Hardwire Minis. And then I also got a pair of sunglasses from them. It comes in this really cute case. And it's key, it's the Key Australia and Desi Perkins collab. And it's these really, really nice sunglasses. These are called the High Key Minis. And I love them. They block the sun out so nice. And they are just like the perfect size sunglass. I love them. Love Key Australia. Definitely going to be ordering more both sunglasses and blue light glasses. They're definitely worth it. They work super, super well. My next accessory is actually the necklace that I'm wearing. I don't know if you guys can really see it. it. Has my boyfriend's name on it. So this is my favorite necklace. It wasn't that expensive, but it doesn't tarnish. When I shower, I always leave my necklaces on when I shower and it has not tarnished, doesn't turn my neck green. I don't have any of those issues. It is my favorite necklace that I own. My next accessory is my Amazon Cartier rings. So I got these two rings right here off Amazon and they were probably $13 each. They look exactly like the Cartier rings. They don't tarnish, they don't turn my finger green. They do scratch a little bit, but they were $13. So I don't, can't really complain. I also have the bracelet. And I got all of this on Amazon. I'm gonna link everything down below. They, everybody thinks they're real. They're not, but they look real. And they're just really good quality for a $13 ring. Now my miscellaneous stuff. So my favorite phone cases right now are from Casetify. I have this one on my phone. I also got this one with my name on it. And I have this mirrored one with my name on it. Um. These are my favorite cases. I, I got the impact case, I think it's called. I got the impact case for all three of these cases and they're my favorite phone cases. So if you're looking for a good case, they are a little on the expensive side, but they're definitely worth it. And last but not least, I have my elephant stuffed animal. I got this at Bed Bath & Beyond. It's lavender scented and you put it in the microwave for like 30 seconds or 60 seconds, I think. And it's really good to help with cramps. I would definitely recommend if you have cramps, this is something you should definitely get. It's really nice to just have to just lay on your stomach if you're laying down. Um, it was definitely, I think it was $30. I think it was on sale. I think it was like 30. Definitely worth it. Smells really good if you're looking for a good um, heat pack. I would definitely recommend it. All right, guys. So that was everything I had to show you today. I will have everything linked down below in the description. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.